Hi, I'm Hazel from Talkie Library and I'm going to show you how to make 3D hot air balloons just like this. So to make your hot air balloon, you're going to need a few pieces of paper depending on how big you want to make your balloon. If you want to make it a big size like this, a whole piece of A4, then uh, obviously you're going to need more paper than if you make one this sort of size. Now I made this template a few years ago when we had a display in the children's library with hot air balloons. And I still like this size, which is why I'm going to use it. But I made the template by drawing kind of balloon shape like this, but making sure it didn't go down in the middle, so that when you open it, it's straight up the top like that. And what you need to do is fold your paper and then with this template, I'm going to put it against the edge, like this. Draw around here. And then cut him out. And you can, I did, I've done these balloons with three pieces, but you can do it with four, five, six, however many you like. But three or four is pretty much the best way. And once you've done that, you gather all the pieces you've cut out, like this and you start sticking them together. Now if you've only got one piece of one colour, make sure that that one's in the middle. So, I'm going to put glue on one side, like this, and stick them together. Now this is the moment where you think, oh no, they're all the wrong shapes, they're all different. It doesn't matter, because when they're all stuck together, you can cut them so that they're all the same size, so you can cut all the little edges off. I'll put a bit of glue on here, like this. Make sure you go down to the bottom bit. Like that. And you can see I've got some bits sticking out. With the scissors, I'll just trim it ever so slightly. Make sure that things are shaped. Like this. Now, the basket at the bottom is just a square, and it's like a house with, you know, with a bit of roof. And you just put a bit of glue on there, and then stick it to the bottom of your hot air balloon like that. And again, you see any bits? You can always trim them off. And another problem. And there we have it, a nice simple 3D hot air balloon. Another bit. How did I miss that one? And you can either, well, it's a bit more, never mind. So you can either make a picture with them. Or you can put them on the wall somewhere, or you can hang them up. And if you want to hang them up, put some more around on this side too. There we are, a hot air balloon. <laughs>